Yes, hello. Hello, sir. Hi. Good morning. My name is Kayur Sane and I'm here for the mock interview. Okay. So, okay. So, it's, I guess, for SQL mock interview. Yes, sir. That's right. So, if we come to a rating, how much rating you will give yourself? So, for trying my level best, I would rate myself 10 on 10 for giving best attempt. Okay. But uh, on the skills level, I would rate myself as 8 on 10. Okay. Okay. So, what is the in operator? So, the in operator, it is uh, used where as an alternative for where and or command. For example, if we have a data where uh, we have countries like UK, US and France. So, instead of using multiple or conditions and multiple where conditions, I can simply use select star from table name where country in UK, comma us comma france so this makes things easy okay suppose if if we don't want to show us and uk then so we do have a function for that so you can directly use select star from table name where not in and the country names which we do not want to see so we can directly use not in okay so what is the like operator so, so the, the like operator uh, is used where we want to match the character strings as per the data. For example, uh, if I have the data for the names and if I'm looking specific to find names where the name starts from A. So I can directly like uh, write select star from table name uh, where name like the percentage sign and A. Okay. Fine. What is the difference between where and having? Uh, so, so the where in the where clause, it can be used without group by, but the having clause, it needs group by. Without group by, we cannot use uh, having clause. And uh, in where statement, we can use it uh, using select, insert, delete. Whereas in having, we can only use it uh, with select clause. And also in where clause, we can uh, we cannot use, use any aggregate functions. And uh, in having clause, we can use uh, aggregate functions as well. Okay. According to you, major having used with the group by. That's right. And can be used where clause in a group by? Yes, we can use it. Okay. Okay. Ta uh, so, do you have used joins? Yes, I do. Okay, so can you tell me the type of joins? Uh, sure, sir. So basically, sir, the joins, it's used to uh, create references or create links between the tables. So there are six types of joins. Okay. Uh, it's left out outer join, right outer join, inner join, full outer, outer join, cross join and self join are the six joins. Uh, okay. Can you tell me the difference between inner join and left outer join? Sure, sir. The In the inner join, uh, common values from both the tables are taken. Whereas in the left join, all the values from left table and common values from left and right are taken. Okay. So, according to you, left everything from left mm -hmm. and common from right. Right. That's right. Okay. What is the, what is the foreign key? Uh, so, so the foreign key is a key uh, which is used to link or establish connection between two tables. So, it is dependent on the primary key and uh, a foreign key can have null values as well. And in simple words, uh, a foreign key is used as a link to establish from the primary key table. Okay. Okay. So, foreign key depend to another table primary. Primary key. Okay. Can we take duplicate foreign key? Yes, we can. Okay. Is it mandatory to give whatever we have given the primary key? In the foreign key, yes. Okay. Is it possible null? Yes, it does take null value. Okay. Okay. So, let's move with the practical. So, is it possible to share your screen? Sure. I can. Okay. Display the record where name is having first character is A. Okay, sure, sir. So, firstly, I'll show the entire table that I have created. So, here is the data that I have created. So, as per your question, uh, I'll write the code for the same. Okay. So, it's select a uh, star from table name. Hmm. Where name, I'll use the function like. Okay. And we want the name start. Uh, which starts from A. So, I'll just give it A and a percentage sign. Let's see if it works. Okay. 
so here it is okay can you sh uh, show me the again your table yes so, so here is the table so i have two names which starts from a i needed to fetch those who have ending with the j okay sure i can do that so in the similar way just right select star from the table name where the name use the percentage sign first and the ending which is j okay and yes here is the output display the name where a is having on a string okay so we basically want names which contain a right anywhere yes. anywhere okay right Yeah, that should work. Yes, sir. This is the output. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Show me your table. Okay, sir. Here is the table. Okay. So, is it possible to show how many type at time ID is repeated? Yes, we can. So, first of all, sir, I I would um. show you if there are any repeated entries and okay. after that we can count the yeah. ids when okay. So so this is showing me uh, the IDs which are repeated okay so in similar way so, so, if uh, so this one show me the IDs which are repeated okay, okay. so can we sh can you show the uh, how many t uh, time ID is repeated uh yes i can so i can just supply a count function here and it will help me to show the exact counts and this should work okay yes. so id 1 it's repeated for around 3 times id 6 is for one time id 2 is for repeated for two times okay what is the distinct according to you uh, so so the distinct function is used to return only the distinct uh, values from a table for example if a table has uh, repeated ids or uh, repeating in a table so by using the distinct function i can just get uh, the distinct values from the table without ensuring that the other values the repeated values are not repeated okay good okay okay thank you thank you for your time thank you sir for your interview thank you